Hi guys, today we will be heading to the St. Paul Church in the morning as well as the mosque which is uh, somewhere around around this, this, this area here. You can actually see it from the corridor of our hotel. As you can see, the view is pretty nice. We are now at A Famosa. It's called the famous in Portuguese. In 16th century, it actually housed hospitals, five churches, and also four key towers. But only the gatehouse is remained until now. This is also the oldest surviving European architecture in Asia. Based on what we have read in that board over there, the wall is 3 meter thick and it's made out of uh, demolished malls, uh, palaces. We are now at the summit of St. Paul Hill, inside St. Paul Church, which is also the oldest church building in Malaysia. We are just done visiting the St. Paul Church as well as the Malacca Hill and now we are going to hunt for our brunch and guess where are we? We are actually back at Jonker Street because it has a lot of uh, good food so we shall see what we will eat Now we are back at Jonker 88 so yesterday if you remember we came here for the candle and today we decided to try the mixture of two kinds of laksa I think it's the Assam laksa and the Baba Nonya laksa <laughs> I hope I got that right Let me just taste the broth Pretty spicy but I like that The noodle is also very soft yeah, it's pretty nice so on top of that, we also ordered a tray of uh, fish cake rojak. I think also one of their specialty. And then we added a uh, tauki. You can see that it's still very crispy. Just let me have a bite of this. Oh. A bit crispy. Um, this that the uh, fish cake is very fresh. I don't know, it's, it's quite good. So now we have stopped by a cafe called Isan. Uh, the reason why we stopped by is because we just wanted something to drink as well as to eat. It's like our after meal dessert. Yeah, so let's see what we have ordered. We have ordered the traditional bean pie. On top of it is actually a word C, which is a Chinese character and is a symbol of uh, marriage. Inside, the filling is a uh, pineapple paste. So let me have a taste. Very crispy. It's a bit sticky. I don't think it's pineapple taste. It's actually local seed taste instead of my apple. And then the skin is actually the tasapia skin. This is the long black. Our all time favorite. Very strong aroma of coffee. I feel it tastes similar to what we usually have in Starbucks. 
But it's way cheaper. It only costs us RM10, and this is RM5. We have just finished our after meal snack and we will be heading to the shopping centers around our hotel we need to escape from the heat and uh, in the evening we will be exploring a mosque by the beach. We'll see you there. Malacca Street Mosque, located in the man-made island in Malacca, opened on 2006. It actually cost 10 million to construct this mosque. We are back here at Jonker Street. Our very first snack at Jonker Street today will be somewhat like the kaya boy I ate yesterday. But this is the Oreo one and this is kaya also. I'll try the Oreo one. Because the Oreo became soft, so uh, it's not really as good. The kaya one is fresh out of the oven, I would say. But it's not really using an oven. Yeah, let me see if it's nice. It has a very strong butter and milk uh, flavour to it and very little kaya. I can't really taste the kaya. It doesn't seem to be like it has <laughs> kaya in it. Maybe you forget to put kaya. But still a great start to our Jonker Street uh, food tour. Uh, it's raining right now. Maybe a bit of drizzling, but hopefully it will stop. The second store is a store that sells uh, drinks and fruit. We haven't been eating any fruits for the past two days, so we are trying their guava with sour plum. This is uh, very hard to fail. Sweet, sour, and crunchy. Very nice. Our healthy snack. Yeah. Very good healthy snack. And it costs only 6 RM. <laughs> It has started to rain and we have bought our third snack which is the popiang. So as you can see it's stuffed with a lot of radish and then a bit of vegetable and carrots. The skin is pretty thick and overall it's not really very salty so it's very light. So it seems that it's a pretty healthy snack because it's all vegetable. It's still raining cats and not outside. That's where we are now. We are actually upstairs of Family Mart. I think if it's not because of rain, we will never discover this place. This is quite an interesting place. It's very spacious. And I think usually they will close this area and the Family Mart staff is quite generous. They actually turn on the electricity uh, after they realize that there are someone is actually occupying the space upstairs. So while we were here, we actually bought our dinner, which is a ice americano and a cup noodle. I think the rain won't stop soon, it's getting heavier and heavier. And I'm just going to stay here until the rain dies down later before we head back to the hotel. We will see you tomorrow. Bye bye.
Thank you for watching. Do hit the like and subscribe button for more travel related videos. Um Okay, we are now at the peak of St. Paul Hills. Uh, the plan is to head to Jonker Street at night because there's a lot of good food to eat and we need to head there back again and again and again and again and again. Mm, good food. Mm. And how explore?